and the movie will go ahead and start. Matt, don't watch the movie. Let's come back. Okay. Uh, let me show you another ad format. This is also an expandable ad format, but in this case, this expandable ad format has, I'm sorry, in this case, uh, I, I jumped ahead of you. Let's go back to the other one. Um, in this case, I'm going to show you a very popular uh, ad format that has been testing incredibly well. This is a click to call ad. In this case, we're leveraging the fact that the user has given us permission to use their location. We know that they're in San Francisco, and Direct TV would like to make a special offer to customers in San Francisco, and they have a new click to call option. So simply clicking on that button on that ad allows the, cu the customer to make that phone call to Direct TV, and uh, that's incredibly valuable. Let me talk about another ad format. This is an, uh, an expandable format with a very clever twist. Matt, why don't you expand this one out? It includes a map and directions and click to call. Isn't that great? That's a new format that will become shortly available as well. Okay, finally, let me show you what I meant when I said open to innovation. This is the weather.com application, and they're using the industry standard double click software to serve this ad from Google. The ad is at the bottom. Now, when Matt clicks on that ad, you get a full screen immersive ad, and it's a pretty amazing ad. Uh, it's got trailers and TV spots and galleries. Not only does it have a bunch of media that you can interact with, look at the bottom there. The bottom has the ability for you to tap directly into Fandango to purchase movie tickets. But you know what the kicker is of what you're seeing? It's not a Google ad. You're seeing an immersive ad format delivered by a great advertising company called Medialets. But because the publisher, because the advertiser, uh, excuse me, the, the ISV, the developer, used double click to serve the ads, double click is open to have any ads show up. And that's what it means to be open. That we serve the most relevant ad to the user, sometimes from Google, sometimes not, but you, the developer, and the publisher have the choice. That's openness. All right, let's go back to slides. If you'd like to learn more about our advertising solutions, we encourage you to go to google.com mobile ads. And to you know, entice your interest a little bit, we're doing two things today. Number one, we're opening up ASMA, AdSense for Mobile Apps, to everybody at the conference, all 5,000 of you. And we're going to sweeten the deal a little bit. If you go sign up, we will give you $100 free advertising credit to start learning the system and advertise your apps in the Android marketplace. So please, go try that out. One of the most powerful ways to demonstrate what I talked about at the beginning, that innovation comes from all levels of the stack, um, is to highlight one of my favorite devices. Uh, this is the uh, device by HTC. It's the Evo device. Now, there's several things I love about this device. One thing I love about the device is it's absolutely gorgeous 4.3 inch screen. I also love how fast it is. I love the great work HTC has done to add value. I love the Sprint network. It's a 4G network. Now, you know what a 4G network can do? It can give you a peak of up to 10 megabits per second. Imagine what you can watch on this device at 10 megabits per second. I love the fact that this device has a great little stand. So you can just set it on the desk, or if you're on an airplane, just set it right there and watch uh, your content. Uh, it's got a great battery. It's got HDMI output. It's got a camera that's eight megapixels, and that will do uh, 720p HD video recording. And you know what I love most about this device? Is that in partnership with Sprint and HTC, Google is going to make this device available to every one of you today. Now, for those of you who are watching on YouTube, I'm sorry. <laughs> Remember to register next year, quickly. Um, I think you're going to love that device. We ask you to do two things. Number one, don't run out right now. After the keynotes are over, we're going to make it available all day until 6 p.m. So you'll have plenty of time to get this device and really uh, get to see the latest in Android innovation. Number two thing we're going to ask, thank you for supporting Android.
Thank you for voting on the side of openness and choice. Please keep building those great apps. Now, we're at the halfway point this morning. We're not done yet. If you'd like to see the next step in the evolution of Android and where we're about to go next, hang tight.